Good happy Wednesday evening, February 23rd, 2022. I'm Riley King. Welcome to this Wednesday evening edition of your evening traffic watch right here on the Riley King Network. Let's get started right now. First up, we're going to take a look at your evening traffic map for this Wednesday evening. And here is a look at that traffic map for all of you for this Wednesday evening. As you can see on 202 around Henniker, you're seeing smooth sailing traffic. Also on 114 around Henniker, you got some medium paced traffic with some smooth sailing traffic. On I-89 around Hopkinton, you got smooth sailing traffic. On I-93 around Bow, Pembroke, and Concord, you got smooth sailing traffic. Also on I-93 around Bosquin and Canterbury, smooth sailing traffic. And also on I-93 around Northfield, smooth sailing traffic as well. On 393 between Concord and Chichester, you got smooth sailing traffic. Then we get into Route 4 in Chichester. You got some medium paced traffic with stop traffic and a little slight smooth sailing traffic. Let's take a look here. Delays of 7 minutes and delays increasing on US 202 Dover Road eastbound between I-93 and Mason Road. Average speed is 15 miles per hour. Also on Route 4 around the Epsom area, same thing, stop traffic, a little bit of medium pace traffic, and smooth sailing traffic. Delays of 8 minutes and delays increasing on US 202 Dover Road eastbound between Horse Corner Road and New Hampshire 28. Average speed is 10 miles per hour. And also on Route 4 around the Northwood area, you got smooth sailing traffic with some medium pace traffic as well. And then over at the Lee Traffic Circle in 125 Lee, you got some medium and slow pace traffic with some smooth sailing. And also um, on Route 4 around the Durham area, you got some medium pace traffic with some smooth sailing. And then over on Route 16 in the Spotling around the Rochester area, you got smooth sailing also on Route 16 and Spotling around the Dover area, smooth sailing as well. In the city of Dover, you got some medium and slow pace traffic. Also on Route 16 around the Newington area on the Spotling, you got smooth sailing traffic with a little bit of medium pace traffic as well. Fort Smith, you got some medium and slow pace traffic and some stop traffic as well. Port Smith and Tamain, you got smooth sailing with some medium and slow pace traffic. On I-95 around the Greenland area, you got smooth sailing traffic. Northampton, you got some medium pace traffic with a little bit of smooth sailing. Hampton, you got some Slow, stopped, and medium paced traffic with a little bit of smooth sailing in Seabrook. You got some slow and medium paced traffic going into the border of Massachusetts. On 101, great ride on 101. Not too bad on 101. On I-93 and I-293 around the Hooks in Manchester area, you got some medium paced traffic with smooth sailing traffic. 114 around the Goffstown area, you got some medium and slow paced traffic and a little bit of stop traffic with a little bit of smooth sailing traffic as well. 101 around the Bedford area, you got slow and medium paced traffic. And 101 around the Amherst area, you got smooth sailing traffic. 101 around the Milford area, you got smooth sailing traffic. Route 13 around the Milford area, you got medium and smooth sailing traffic. On Route 3 around the Merrimack area, you got smooth sailing traffic with some medium paced traffic. And also on Route 3, you got 
around the Nashua area, you got smooth sailing traffic in Nashua South, smooth sailing traffic into the border of Massachusetts. 101A between Nashua and Milford, you got medium and slow paced traffic with tiny bits of smooth sailing traffic. In the city of Nashua, you got medium and slow paced traffic with a few spots of smooth sailing traffic as well. On I-93, all the way to the border of Massachusetts, you got smooth sailing traffic with some spots of medium pace traffic. And Route 28, all the way to the border of Massachusetts, same thing as well. You got smooth sailing traffic with spots of slow and medium pace traffic. And that is a look at your evening traffic map this evening. Now, let's take a look at your traffic cam, and here is a look at your I-93 traffic cam. Boo, New Hampshire I-93 traffic cam is provided by New Hampshire DOT. And as you can see, you got cars moving in both directions and moving pretty good. Not no delays or anything like that in this section of the highway. So that is good news there. And that does it for this evening Traffic Watch right here on the Riley King Network. If you do spot a traffic issue, be sure to share it with the Riley King Network so we can let our viewers know. Thank you for tuning in and watching. Good night and goodbye.